Hi, and welcome to today's B tutorial. Today we're going to show you how to create a CTA button that's bulletproof on top of a background image in the B editor. So just like this REI email, which is beautiful inspiration for us, we want to have a big background image that has live text on it and then a bulletproof button. This button is actually an image and you can layer images in B, but we're going to show you how to create a background image with a bulletproof CTA button, which is an email design best practice. So over in the B editor, we are going to go ahead and start with a blank template to get started. And to have a background image in B, one that you can pull text over top of and a button over top of, you just need to go ahead and let B know once you click on any row that it is going to be a background image. So we're going to go ahead and activate that. And then to add an image from our, our uh, free library, we're going to go ahead and hit change image and then browse for one. You can also import an image of your own, but today we're going to search for free photos. Our free photos libraries come from Unsplash, Pexels, and Pixaboy, so there are a ton of images to look at. We're going to look for camping, just drawing inspiration from that REI email. And I'm going to click through and just look for one that catches my eye. This one looks good. I like that it's vertical. So I'm going to go ahead and import that one. And right now, B is adding it to our photo library. And then from there, I can add it, insert it into, into the email itself. So since there isn't any content here, we can only see a little bit of the email. Um, I'm going to change it to be centered instead of full width. And to get a peek at this image, I'm going to just kind of add this text box and let us see it. And I can tell that the image is really way too big. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and edit it to be smaller. And I can do that in the built-in editor right here. So I'm going to go ahead and resize it. And let's say we we'll just want it to be 800 pixels wide. I think that'll be a lot better for the email. So we can go ahead and save and see how that looks now is better but it looks like it's still a little bit too big there we go so now we have this awesome email or a background image rather and i can pull content on top of it like this text box i have right here and our CTA button. So now what I'm going to do is go ahead and add text. And format. And really all we're doing now is formatting. Our CTA button is in. It's already bulletproof, which means it's going to show up in every email client and on any device, which is great. Let's see a little bit bigger, maybe. I can center that. And then I'm going to see another bit of text here. Going to type it all out right now. The main thing we're going to do is format this button. And the button says start your journey. It's a transparent background. Text looks good. I'm going to add a border here. Oops. 
to get in. And then just to make sure we can see our image, I'm just going to create that little space there. And you can see that now we have live text and our button on top of the background image. And we can go ahead and pull in other modules, but this is the gist of how to do it. It's pretty easy, pretty fun.